plays like a beauty again. See, I think I'm just going to retire mine and get a completely new controller. Not a bad idea right? either, but okay, we're getting the mix up here with the Terry. Oh. Terry Beauregard? Yeah. Hey, I love watching Terry. Uh, Jolie is one of my favorite players at Zeno, so I'm always down to watch some Terry action. And Jolie's attitude is also very wholesome. Yes, he's so Brooklyn, it's insane. He's what do you mean, Brooklyn? I thought he was just nice. Nah. Is Brooklyn just nice? I think Brooklyn's just nice. Brooklyn's like a harsh nice, like where they're like, you're an idiot, but I'll help you change your tire. You know what I, I, mean? I like that. Uh, you're talking about the difference between nice and kind. Yes. Yes. yes the East Coast versus West Coast. Yeah. As someone from California, yes, it's very true. Yeah. <laughs> but Jolie's like the epitome of it. Like I was playing him in friendlies, and every time I'd roll in, he'd be like, "Oh, you rolled in again." Like he does the same oh! thing. That was oh my sick. god, Ray Luna yeah. with the nice down smash and ledge. <laughs> That is the problem with uh, Terry's recovery, is that you do do the rising tackle, and it doesn't snap to ledge, so that just makes them... I, that, you know, that's also going to make this matchup very hard for Vivi. I don't know what they're thinking right now, but you yeah. know what? She knows better than I do. Yeah, very true, you know? She's in top six, and we're commentating. So. Listen, so. listen. Doesn't mean we don't know a thing or two about a thing or two. That's right, that's right. And hey, Ray Luno knows a thing or two. Finding these combos! Oh, oh. good trade! It is a frame one air neutral air, so Vivi's Jeez. using that to their advantage. That's probably why she chose this character, is to just use those as a combo breaker to get out of any dangerous situations. If you're not going to be, be perfect on your SDI, you might as well have something that uh, comes out fast frame one. That makes sense, but Vivi having a hard time finding this first stock, finding really many hits at all here. Uh, it's kind of been all Ray Luno as we see Ray Luno take Vivi all the way off stage and back again. I buy that cereal. Oops, all Ray Luno. <laughs> Oops, all Ray A berries. combo in every bite. Yeah. <laughs> combo flavors. Uh oh. Oh, oh that's within my beloved. Yeah, that was a that was a save if, and a half if I've ever seen one. Oh, but the up out of shield gonna be enough to take the stock, Bayonetta, pretty light. But Vivi unfortunately has been pressuring Ray Luno's shield over and over. I mean it's Terry, you kinda have to go, you know, roll up your sleeves, go fist the cuffs. But it's been so hard to get anything off of that. Not enough to kill, but yep, in a really bad spot there. Had to burn the air dodge. Ray Luno capitalizing. Vivi losing the go meter. I don't know if there's going to be a way back here, but hey, if anyone's going to find it, it's her. You know how you were telling me when you were trying to find a character, you wanted to play someone where every single move is hype? Yeah. That's Terry. Yes. Every single move is hype. Yes, it was It was Jolie who gave me that advice. He's like, I play Terry because every single move is hype. I was like, ah, oh, you might be onto something, man. Well, let's see if Vivi's onto something right here on the, her last stock. Needs to take this stock from Ray Luno right now to stand a chance. How do you even edge guard a Bayo right now? Yeah, for real. You don't. <laughs> That's the answer. But go meters up. So, you know, you find you find a little something. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh. Yeah, but now when the go meter is up, Ray Luno's like, hey, I'm going to go too yeah. to the top. Yeah, for real. And you could, you could power geyser all you want. You could take this stock, but... Every hit that uh, Ray Luna lands, you're, you're just getting closer and closer to death. Like, you're going to have to play through this stock perfectly. You're going to have to play through the next stock perfectly, and that's going to be really tough. Well, the good thing is that Go is always going to be here, though. Yeah. So, VB once Bayo comes down, there we go. There you go. So, we're going to see some confirms into confirms into confirms. Are you okay? Over and over and over until Ray Luna is at 80%. There's yeah. the first. Where's the next? As long as VB can have... Uh, no way, no that way. Kills? No, no way, oh my god. But just like that, 80%. But you're right, yeah. Yeah, Vivi's so bad. No! Jesus! No! Ray Luno fumbled it! I jinxed the hell out of that one. <laughs> Good gracious. Okay. That right. was two Buster Wolves and a Power Geyser, and your stock is gone. I mean, that's the problem. And Ray Luno was playing that matchup very well, realizing, hey, if you get to 100%, you need to die now. Yeah. Because if not, we're going to get that situation where you're going to get three confirms, and I will be a death percentage. <laughs> Good <laughs> lord. Ray Luno, are you okay? <laughs> Anything oh. but okay. Oh, tried yeah. to actually forward tilt out of shield yeah. right there. What a big mistake. Yeah. But let's see if they've learned from those mistakes into game two. Yeah, it's going to be tough for Ray Luno here when you get cooked like that last stock, you know. Coming into another game so fast, you know, you don't have your momentum anymore. So let's see if Vivi can capitalize on that here early. Here we go. My favorite old skin for Terry, the yellow. I'm also a big yellow fan on Terry, for sure. Oh, this is bad. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. I saw that down there. The heel coming out. Yeah, good job getting off ledge with crack shoot and then pushing advantage from Vivi. Oh, here we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Combos. Bringing him around town. 
Double take three times. <laughs> Whoa, what was that? <laughs> uh, I like how Ray Luna's playing a little more grounded here, keeping VV up in the air here in a juggle situation. Yeah, maybe looking for an air dodge in there with that F smash, but uh, VV, a good job just taking your time off stage, not rushing in with any committal options, making your way back and binding that punch. It doesn't feel like VV has actually gotten a lot of like the confirms from stuff, but already at 114, oh, that's unfortunate. No tech. <laughs> no tech Wednesday. Okay, but here we go, trying to just press the shield there. But yeah, Terry's one of those characters where it's like you blink and you're at 100, and it's like, I, I feel like I've been adv advantaged the whole game. What happened? Yeah. yeah. That's just Veil life right there. Yeah, for real. Didn't I just do 200 damage on you and you're still living? <laughs> Didn't I get Power Geyser at 60 and I'm dead? <laughs> <laughs> All right, nice little heal slide there. Once more to just get out of the situation. It's like Terry's crack shoot, only not as good. Yeah, these getup attacks have been absolutely lethal from BV, breaking oh. up these combos from Ray Luna, who I think has been committing to to some committal options a little bit too early. I think so, but you know, once a, a good out shield option there with the witch twist. Yeah. Good job. Oh, oh my god! That was sick. You think it's over? You think oh Bayo's burned every option that uh, she has to recover? No. Then you get back aired, you get cooked. You always have to keep in mind that Raylan is very good at actually canceling the double witch twist in so that they can keep a third jump. Yeah, that was sick for sure, but hey, you you almost just died at 80 to an uncharged uh Buster Wolf. Don't don't remind Ray Luno. You'll psych him out again. <laughs> yeah, for real. Flashbacks to the last game. No, no. Right, don't let him get okay. VV forced that platform. Yeah, VV's actually not gotten go meter, except the one time where. Oh my god, if that kills. Yeah, that was crazy. It looked like a shield poke on that too. Vivi. Oh, unfortunately, Crack Shoot going the wrong way. She needs to find a kill here soon. Ray Luna racking it up to 123 though, so any little touch will kill. You gotta watch out for that upbeat. Whoa, yep. whoa, whoa. That shield that comes out just as fast as Witch Twist. All right, nice little power knuckle. Yeah, power knuckle. Oh, the power. dash attack into the kill. Yeah, power knuckle won't take it, but dash attack certainly will. For something that was looking like Ray Luno's blowout game, has turned back into Vivi's favor. Yeah, but hey, you know, you Vivi doesn't have go meter yet. You have him at like optimal percent here, 96. This is when, as Ray Luno, you want to find some confirm or some combo that will take him. Don't give Vivi the options that she had last game. Vivi doesn't even need go meter. <laughs> Look at her. So poised. Okay, maybe she needs it. Oh, uh, that'll do She it. needed it a little bit before oh, that. Oh, great DI from Vivi. Oh my god. Uh-oh. No way. No I to just get some momentum there to get back to near center stage. Oh, oh my god! You're good okay, not enough. Power. Do it again. Dash attack? Maybe something. We're gonna see, uh, yep. Every Bayonetta does that. <laughs> Vivi right. not quite ready for it. Ooh, That's good gonna, no, no, still nothing. Terry, heavier than you think. Ray Luno did a great job of getting out of oh, oh my god! Oh! Okay, the double way AVK back. into the back air. Fine, we got a game three. Woo, talk about like a reversal of fortune there. Holy moly, that power geyser was probably like two frames away from landing. <laughs> good gravy. And Ray Luno doesn't even look phased. I'm over here being like, Ray Luno, you mad man. Yeah, I'm phased. I'm phased, right? This was sick. Right? Oh, can't do that. You can't do that. You have to. Vivi's got go meter. Yeah. You have no choice but to kill. Yeah, for real. Vivi did a great job coming back from behind that game again, though. Like, good gracious. Like, if I'm Ray Luna, I'm sweating. Oh, the ABK just coming out much faster. Choosing a, a good, faster option there in the air. It's what they needed to escape. And we're going hero. The hero's coming we out. We no longer believe in the Terry. We're bringing out the hero. <laughs> yeah, congratulations, Ray Luna. <laughs> you have brought out the hero. And the switch to Pokemon Stadium here is a great counter pick for uh, Vivi, who now has the room to play around as hero. I feel like there's two types of characters who generally zone. There's those who don't want a lot of room, and there's those who do. And Hero is one of those characters where they're gonna maybe get Accelerate up and then run around the stage, get their best options up, get the oomph up, get the psych up up, and then, uh, and then cook. I right. think that can kind of play both those extremes. You know, you can have kind of like, oh, I can have a lots of room to set up what my neutral is and avoid a lot of your attacks versus, okay, now I'm in and you're going to get 120% maybe death. Yeah. And there it goes. Uh-oh. Going to the top. No. Not enough to kill. But 54%. Yeah, Nothing you'll take that. Ooh, here we go. VV trying to find a way back in here off the edge, but can't do it. Ray Luno, great job of pushing advantage. Ooh. 
I think Vivi's just a little afraid to pull out that menu. Haven't seen that yet, except we get a zoom back on center stage. No, the platform, perfect for Raylino to catch them. Ooh, yeah, I think she might want to think about getting an accelerate up here uh, and then moving around the stage to browse that menu more. Backers coming oh out. Ray Luna going deep. No, zoom, zoom. Mm. Oh, oh, no, using the wind, actually. Good yeah. stuff. Back air. I mean, back throw. Ooh, sizzle coming out. A little scary. As long as Vivi just... This is the problem also with Hero. They do have the disjoints, but their sword comes out so slow and predictable that Ray Luna probably could get either a witch time or even just a bats with them to avoid it. Yeah, Hero, it's like a secret Bowser. <laughs> you know, that back air comes out so late, but man, does it hit like a truck. Oh my, oh my god. Oh! oh. Really? That's tough, but hey, you know, Vivi's at 141, so you can still find a kill pretty quick here. Sending him the wrong way. Oh, Not no! again! Oh, no! Oh my god! Oh! Ray Luno, usually a master of being able to come back from anywhere off stage, has unfortunately SD twice. But hey, maybe Vivi dropping her guard a little because Ray Luno finds that 72 damage combo a little bit too committal with that down smash there. Might have been better to just wait it out. Just a little bit, but it also forces Vivi to kind of throw out the first action. Once you've exhausted your double jumps, hey, and now I can chase you. Ooh, good Kazap coming out. There's that oh whoosh. Oh my god. The outer shield whoosh onto the platform. Hero players Not again. love this. Not again. Yeah, yeah. Ops to recover high there, taking no chances. All right, that thwack Jump there. into the whack. Jump into the whack. I'm not phased. They're like, yeah, very SD twice. What's the yeah, other time? Yeah, for real. Oh, good parry coming out, but with Accelerate up, there's no punish off that. All right, double dunk. Heal. Okay, this is big. Ooh. Oh, my God. Yeah, just outside of that range. Good job avoiding the Sizz, but man. Can't avoid the Zapple, though. Covers Psych up. so much. Oh, it just needs one back air. There it isn't. Or maybe even a grab can kill at this range. Yeah, maybe an up throw. Oh, or a forward air. Yep, that'll do it. Tough from Ray Luno. You never want to end your top six run with two SDs in a game. But it just hurts because you would think that that would get to last off last hit situation from how well both players are playing. But, you know, once you're there and you you lose yours to like being like, oh, okay, I accidentally like reacted into the air dodge on stage. Mm. Didn't have time to do that. But then what was the second one? The double ABK. They jump back. Missed the ledge. Oh, you just missed the no. Ledge. Yeah. They just barely missed the ledge. No air dodge actually into the ledge. I yeah. thought that would have actually done it, but I thought, I guess they believe that they re could recover a little bit lower. But you know, this is what happens. You always got to be on top of your resources as a resource heavy character with Bayo, whose resources are, you know, an off stage situation, but that's the only way you're going to be able to recover consistently. Yeah.